to have the Olympics in town, a mini involved in the sponsorship, it just seemed like an absolute natural thing to do to pay a homage, if you like, to that fabulous film in this uh, great city where the games are going to be played. It's a take on the uh, Italian job, which uh, on the top of the script says Britalian job. Do you see what they've done there? We've got three Italian job-esque minis and we're going to be cruising across London at breakneck pace, but all legal, mind you. And uh, we are shooting at a breakneck pace, which is slightly daunting. Timing is the issue the whole time. We've got a lot of stuff to do. This is a bit in the story where Daly's given them the call, they've got to get in their minis, charge out onto the streets of the West End at night and basically charge up for the biker who has stolen something very precious. So I'm the blue overalls uh, chaser. Daly's been our boss, we've just been chasing around London. It's been great fun. I feel a bit like a film star, eh? Today, I'm the white driver. It's been great pretending to be a stunt driver. I'm the baddie and I've just stolen something. I actually quite, quite enjoy playing a baddie. I always thought I'd be a nice kind of goodie. It's been really, really fun. I had an amazing cast with me. This is my first scene and uh, I'm on a motorbike. I've been chased by the minis. I think I've got a slight advantage with the size of my bike. How often do you get to fly around on the streets, pavements and underpasses with police actually helping you do it? Our primary issue is safety. Uh, we've got to make sure that everybody on the uh, filming is safe, plus all the members of the public. We're now at the beginning of the chase proper. And this is quite an important scene. This is where they first encounter the bike. We're reenacting um, that sort of famous scene where the cars come down the steps uh, on, on the wedding day and wish the happy couple obviously good luck. Slight twist to it, the Olympians have been exercising on the steps just before the bike arrives and having a never give up attitude, they keep on working while the bike winds its way through. I'm obviously a little bit nervous uh, going into this, but you know we've done everything we can to make it safe. It's all been prepped very well and the Mini's handled it perfectly, brilliant. And what a lovely scene with them zigzagging across the steps, it's sensational. Yeah. It's half past 12 on a Thursday night and it looks like rush hour. So the police have got to do a bit of clever locking down for us here. They'll probably stand out on the road and just give us one minute, two minute lockdowns max. It's been fantastic working with everybody all the way through. I really enjoyed it. My favourite stunt would definitely have to be going over the minis. Underground lair, Daly's lair, beginning of the film, the Prime Minister calls, off they go and the chase begins. It's been a, a lot of fun, obviously it's a, a lot different from my, from my everyday life, because obviously in real life I'm the Prime Minister, so this has, been, uh, this has been a nice break to see how spies do it. It's been a lot of fun, everybody's made it a very pleasant day. Today has been monumentally difficult, we've just had a torrential downpour, we're going to do the jump. I'm doing a, a jump with all three cars airborne. We've only got quite a small area in front of the uh, Olympic Stadium. I'm feeling really happy now we've managed to get the jump done today. Probably the trickiest day in that we had to do a lot of pieces in the lair. We had a huge problem kind of moving everyone over to here and then it started to rain heavily and at one point I thought that it was all kind of going a little bit wrong but it managed to all come good in the end. To do a homage, you know, 40 years on from when the original was filmed in London, London 2012 Olympics, it's fantastic. Thank you.